Hi, I'm Nathan from Aussie Green Farm, and today we've got a stink bug infested lemon tree. These are bronze orange bugs, which are here on this tree, and have taken over it. So what they do is, they suck the sap from the new shoots and the leaves, and then they lay the eggs underneath. So you can see the damage here on these leaves. And so because then the plant is under stress, you're gonna get not much of a crop. So it's best to get rid of these uh, bugs as quickly as possible. So there's two methods that you can remove the bugs. Uh, one is where you make sure you have some long gloves on, you're covered up, uh, you've got eyewear on, and a face mask is optional. And you take the bugs off by hand and you put them into some hot water with some soap or some water with no flame spirits. So that's one way. Or Another option is to use a vacuum that has a sealable bag so you can then just throw the bag out into the bin and then you're not grabbing the bugs by hand and killing them or shaking the bugs and jumping on them you just put them into a vacuum bag and then pop them out in the bin and it's a lot easier and you can get the bugs without being sprayed and the smell is not as bad. So here you can see here's one of the bugs there gently show you so there's one they normally hang out in pairs on the tree you can see a couple down here uh, and they're all over this tree so we're going to get started I'm going to wear some eyewear anyway just for the safety aspect and then we'll get started So using the vacuum is a quick and easy way to remove the bugs. Uh, there's a slight smell in the air, but it's not like when you grab them by hand. I think this is a much safer way for you and a bit more humane uh, for the insects. So what you want to do is you want to get rid of all the bugs and then look at the leaves underneath and see if there's any eggs. If there are any eggs on the leaves, take the whole leaf off and make sure you dispose of it properly because if you don't get rid of the eggs, you're just gonna have the same issue in a couple of months. About a week after you do it once, come back over and check your tree again. Make sure you haven't missed any, make sure some more haven't flown in, and then you should be right to go. So if you have multiple citrus trees in your yard, there's a good chance all of them have these stink bugs on. So you can see here, we've just done one lemon tree. We completed those two lime, the kaffir lime and the lime tree on the weekend. And now this orange tree has stink bugs all over it as well. You can see the number of stink bugs on the orange tree and the damage that they've already done to the leaves. We want to try to get rid of these bugs as soon as we can to give the tree the best chance to recover and to fruit for the upcoming season. So what you can see here on this lime tree is this is where the stink bugs suck the sap out from the leaves. So as you can see, like, and the same on this kaffir lime tree, they are, they've done quite a bit of damage here uh, across the whole tree. So once these are removed, switch out this couple here. Uh, once these are removed, the tree can start repairing itself. Uh, so what could also help uh, your trees is if they've got extensive damage uh, like these ones, just uh, apply some citrus fertilizer uh, just to whip them to help them rejuvenate and get back to a healthy tree. So after removing the stink bugs uh, from the Maya lemon tree, it has a growth. It's grown over, over a meter uh, since we were here last and it's only been two months, uh, three months and it is stacked now with plenty of massive lemons which is super juicy 
This is a quick note to let you know that Aussie Green Farm has a bunch of really cool videos to come, including interviews, how-tos for gardening, gardening product reviews and much much more. So click subscribe to stay in the loop.